Girl, I'm tired. Oh, just leaving the gym, girl, and I am done, girl. Bitch, I pushed myself pretty hard today, and when I tell you something, bitch, girl, girl, the, let me tell y'all something, first of all, probably the reason that I was pushing myself was I was just in the presence of so much fucking beauty this evening, y'all bitch when I tell you like everyone well, well not everyone girl <laughs> okay <laughs> let me stop exaggerating girl because not everyone can be amen and it's the truth girl <laughs> you know no offense to the you know <laughs> the facially challenged girl and the you know there but <laughs> this ain't about y'all this is about being surrounded by beautiful people <laughs> I, that just came off so superficial. Y'all know how the fuck I feel. I love everybody. But anyway, girl. Um, there was so much beauty in the building. Like, girl. Now, there were some moments where I was like, girl, it's time to pull that cooch up. Because I saw a lot of camel toes, honey. But then again, I go up for dick prints. So, you know, I'm gay. So, I love dick. Hello. Let's just keep that real. I'm not, I'm not on the hunt for cooch. But at the same time, I can't be tripping when a girl it can't help her print okay like anyway but i was just going and going and going like the energizer bunny girl like i oh and i feel like i'm gonna regret every bit of it tomorrow because i feel like as my body's relaxing again i feel the pain about to take place but it's fine because like i said girl i've been you know treating the gym like a distant friend for the past week so this is day two back in action hello god i'm gonna do my best to go the rest of the week amen gotta get back on my i'm not gonna lie i've been low-key i'm not gonna say i've been cheating my diet but i've kind of you know loosened the restrictions girl in the past week i'm still you know partaking in fruits and vegetables and things of that nature but i'm not gonna lie i've indulged someone uh, commented in one of my videos a while back, I love when you be cheating. I, and when I read the comment, I was like, how the fuck this bitch know I be cheating? So I go to looking around like, bitch, we got spies in the area, girl. Like, so every time I wanna, well, you know, I can't have ice cream anymore. So, oof. I've switched to um, sorbet. I love sorbet, you know, and Italian ice. Oh, girl. I forgot how addictive Italian ices were, child. Ooh, but anyway, girl. Um, I think I have a new gym bag, girl. Like, remember the other one I talked about when I first started this, you know, journey, girl? He's not no longer around. Like, I saw him a couple of times in the beginning, and, like, he's poof, bitch. You know, like, gone, girl. I hope he's okay. He might not even live here. He might have just been visiting or on business or whatever, but fuck that nigga because he ain't around we done moved on girl so i don't know like we'll see girl like i don't you know i don't ever want to say that i feel like someone is you know looking at me or trying to get with me i don't ever want to put that on nobody because there could be just you know some coincidences right i don't know with this one there have been two occasions now before i took my week hiatus this is when I saw this dude. He is very beautiful. He's a very beautiful man. You can tell he's new to that gym because he did, he wasn't there when I first started uh, almost two months ago. So I saw him like the day or two before I took my week hiatus and then I caught him again today. Um, and there were just too many moments where we ended up in the same you know area as each other and I noticed that he wasn't doing nothing. He would just come over to where I was at. And, you know, we ended up in the bathroom a couple of times and didn't say nothing because there's people around. You know, I'm not, I told you, I'm a very shy person. Like, if you know me, know me, you'll be like, oh, yeah, this bitch is not the YB. Like, we're used to on here. No, like, in person, I'm very shy. I'm very, like, to myself, I'm, a very, I'm a very much a loner. You know what I'm saying? Like, so, like, it's, I'm not, and plus the whole courting vibe, I'm, I'm from the, the world of being direct. So, I don't want to scare nobody off because I'm one of those people like, girl, what's the tea? <laughs> you know, like, sometimes, let's, 
beat the stop beating around the bush fuck this whole courting moment you know what i'm saying let's get to it girl you know fuck that shit but now i'm older i have cooth about myself girl <laughs> you know so i'm trying to be different you know what i mean but we'll see you know we left at the same time like i felt like he was watching me because i was definitely looking at him from afar girl but you know we'll see girl we'll see i would like to start dating again i'm not gonna lie i would like for someone to just take me out on a date girl and make me feel like a real woman girl you know <laughs> a real man let me stop saying that because i'm a man and i love being a man but y'all know what i be meaning like girl make me feel real girl you know looking out on the window pane <laughs> you know what i'm saying like make me feel like a woman honey mm. Cause you make me feel, you know, child. Ooh, who's that? <laughs> you see, I just be switching out, girl. See, I ain't, I ain't no good, girl. You know, he's cute though. He looks like he's of the Spanish persuasion, which is fine with me because I could go for something different. You know, in Spanish, like I keep saying, they're romantic, crazy, but they're romantic. Black dudes, I'm kind of getting over black dudes, to be honest with you, child. Mm -hmm. I, I hate to be like that, but I love black men, trust me. But girl, does that mean that we're compatible? You know, and I don't want to generalize all black men, but bitch, at least the, I guess, just like we talked about in the Yes God Round Table, I get, I, you know, I guess I too attract raggedy ass niggas. But, you know, I'd love to, you know, dip in the Spanish pond, honey. Hello, God. Hmm. And I was looking at us in the mirror today. <laughs> um, and we look good. To, we would look really good together. We would look extremely well. Only thing is, like, I think I'm a little bit taller than him. Uh, that's a little turn off for me. But then I had to think about it. I'm six foot one. So most of the guys that i am and have been with have been a lot shorter than me because six foot one is you know pretty tall and uh contrary to popular belief not all black men not all men are tall people and that's fine too because you know what i've learned from my experience girl the sh the shorter the man huh trust me life and its perfect way of balancing things out honey be blessing the shit out of these short niggas girl hmm slang a dang 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 on your motherfucking ass bitch girl there was this one guy I was with some years back girl when he's like five six bitch i'm six foot one so girl first of all we look like a circus act <laughs> <laughs> in the bedroom girl okay but bitch when i tell you when daddy dropped them motherfucking drawers girl his dick had to be like maybe 10 11 inches girl just girl Ooh, girl my stomach hurts just thinking about it oh girl he used to dog walk my motherfucking ass girl mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. oh yeah that's funny <laughs> But anyway, the gym was cute. You know, it's becoming more packed and packed. I'm, I'm seeing a lot of new faces in there, girl. So, you, girl, the gym memberships must be selling. Like, for real, girl. Make me want to invest in a Planet Fitness, girl. Like, ugh. Anyway, that's all I got to give y'all. I'm home now. I'm tired. Y'all be blessed and never stressed. Have a good day. And remember, health is wealth. Bye.